everyone, I'm Kim from Piper Moon Yoga, and today we're gonna light up our glutes. So this is a short but very effective practice, and you can combine this with your yoga practice or whatever exercise routine you use, or you can just do this as a standalone practice. So let's get started. So coming to hands and knees tabletop, we want to take the time to just build a really stable foundation here because tabletop will be our home base for this practice. So stacking our shoulders over our wrists, our hips are over our knees, we have a nice long spine here. So we're not rounding the back and we're not arching the back, we have a nice flat back. All right, so just taking a moment here, find that foundation. And we'll start with just a little stretch here. So extending the right leg long, bringing the toes down to the mat, pressing in through the heel, feeling a nice stretch in that leg. Beautiful, lifting that foot up, bringing it over to the left side, crossing it over, looking over that left shoulder, feeling a nice twist here. Beautiful, coming back to center, bringing that knee back down to the mat and extending your left leg along now, bring those toes to the mat, pressing in through the heel, feeling that nice stretch. And lifting that foot up, crossing it over to the right side, looking over that right shoulder. Beautiful, coming back to center. All right, again, building that stable foundation. And if you'd like to slide a blanket under your knees or fold up your mat for a little bit more support, you can do that. Okay, so let's get started. So extending our left leg long, we're gonna float our right fingertips. So we're reaching that right hand forward, we're reaching that left foot back, really good. And then we're gonna bring the elbow to the knee under the body and extend it long and bring it back in. We'll do eight of these. This is three, four, Doing great. One more. And we're gonna hold it here. Pulling that belly button in towards the spine. Nice core engagement here. Beautiful. All right, moving on to the next thing. We're gonna move our right arm over to the right and our left leg over to the left and then bring it back to center. And doing this for eight counts. Doesn't have to be a huge movement here. Five, six, seven, you're doing great. Eight, beautiful, bringing it back to center. And let's bring that hand down to the mat, keeping that leg extended long. We're going to bend the knee and press the foot up towards the ceiling and bring it back down two, three, four, five, woo, six, seven, and eight, beautiful. All right, bringing that knee down just for a moment, just checking into our foundation here, making sure we're still strong. We're gonna move into what I call the fire hydrant. <laughs> So bringing our knee out to the side like you're a dog doing what dogs do on fire hydrants, bringing it back down and open up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Holding it here, we're gonna extend that foot back and bring it in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Holding it here, we're gonna open up, lifting up that left hand up into the air, finding your balance, holding this, 
We're not only working our glutes, we're also working our core. Beautiful. Now taking that left hand and bringing it towards the top of the mat, bicep by the ear, we're gonna bring the knee to the elbow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Beautiful, holding it here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Extend long, bring that hand to the hip. Let's just lift up this left leg. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Beautiful, bring the hand back down bringing the knee down, maybe making a few hip circles here. Woo, I'm feeling the heat. We're gonna move in the other direction now. All right, so extending that right leg long, the left fingertips reach forward, holding it here, and then bringing the knee and the elbow together two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, and hold it here. Really beautiful. All right, moving that left hand to the left, that right leg to the right, and then bringing it back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Bring it back in. Beautiful. Bringing that left hand down, we're gonna bend that knee and press that foot up towards the ceiling. Two, three, you're so strong. Four, five, six, seven and eight beautiful bring that knee down for just a moment let's just check our foundation here make sure we're stable moving into our fire hydrants so lifting up one two three four five six seven and eight hold it here and extend the leg back one, two, three, four, woo, five, six, seven, and eight, holding it here, and now opening up the body, lifting up that right hand, woo, finding your balance, taking a moment here, find some stability, so strong bringing that right hand towards the top of the mat, bicep by the ear, We're gonna bring elbow to knee. Two, three, four. They don't have to touch, they just need to come near each other. Six, seven, and eight, holding it here. Four, five, six, seven, eight, you're amazing. All right, extending long, bring that hand to the hip and do our little leg lifts here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, you're almost done. Eight, beautiful. Bringing the hand down, the knee down. Go ahead and push back into a much deserved child's pose. Feeling that release, that should feel really good. And at this time, you can do any other stretches that feel good in the body. Maybe you do some hip circles, maybe some down dog would feel really good on the glutes, on the whole body. You really did amazing 
If you like this video, go ahead and give us a like and please subscribe to our channel. That's super helpful. And we'll see you next time.